over here messing stuff up, man. Yo, it is your boy Rex, back here with another video. I just finished getting my truck completely emptied out, and we're about to go return this truck. But before we jump into this video, make sure to give me that thumbs up, smack that subscribe button, and let's go rock. What's up, y'all? Pulling up to the Prime Terminal here in Springfield, Missouri. Uh, and I'm about to go talk to uh, these ladies and gentlemen over here at Success Leasing so I can get my, return my truck. Uh, but first I gotta go uh, meeting up here. I'm meeting my boy, Dre. Cool, we good, we good. We smooth, man, we smooth. Real, real smooth, smooth operator. I'm a smooth operator. Hey, what you doing there, Mr. Prime? What you doing, Prime? Come on, man. We got, you guys, you guys, skedaddle, man. Let's roll. I don't know what you're doing, man. Oh, I gotta go over here and meet my boy Dre. He's here on the, he's, he's here at the yard. Uh, my boy Dre, uh, we both got our license and tested out on the tanker and, and passed on our first try and got our CDL license through Prime. Uh, he picked a reefer and he recently, he recently switched over to a uh, tanker on the food grade side and he did have a freight liner but now he has a mid-roof uh, Peterbilt and he does not have a fridge. Now since Prime is not going to give me any credit for the fridge I bought through them, I'm going to hook my boy up selling my fridge for 100 bucks. So we're about to go meet my boy Dre. I got I to gotta stop somewhere so I can text him or give him a call to find out where he's at or maybe well i'll just bump into him let's go find where let's go find where my boy's at here yeah i'm i'm freaking exhausted uh yesterday i drove 11 hours and then spent about three to four hours clearing out my truck you really don't know how much crap is that my boy dre right that's my boy dre right there let's see what's up with my boy dre that's him right here i think that's him here in this silver the silver I got you. <laughs> Where are you parking at? Where are you park? Yeah, he got him a nice mid roof. Uh, nice mid roof Peterbilt right there. I like the silver with the blue. That's nice, man. That's real nice. Yeah, that's my boy right there. Uh, he needs a fridge, so. Now, I bought this fridge through, through Prime and I paid them 50 bucks to install it. I could have installed it myself, but <clears throat> I just said, why not just have them do it? Because if anything goes wrong with it, then it would be on them, so. But they're not going to give me any type of credit for this fridge, so my boy needs a fridge, so I'm going to hook him up before I uh, turn my truck in. Hey, what is going on, YouTube? I'm here with my boy, Dre, and we are down here at his truck. I'm turning my truck in today and had to take the fridge out. My boy, Dre, needed a fridge. Me and my boy, Dre, we both graduated the same day and got our CDL license through Prime, and he actually graduated. Uh, we both uh, tested out in a tanker. And he did go to Reefer. Go ahead and tell everybody what you think about Reefer and why you switched. Um, I feel like if you're coming into trucking, you brand new to trucking, try Reefer first, man. Reefer is so easy to get into, man. You, all you're doing is backing up to a door and opening up your doors, man, backing into it. So you're really going to learn a lot of skills with Reefer, man. You're going to learn how to back up more, and you're going to learn how to drive. So if you're coming in like brand new, never drove a truck before, start Reefer, man. It's tanker shit and all that, like Reefer. It's gonna, I mean, uh, tanker and flatbed, that's specialized at the end of the day, man. So, in my opinion, man, come into Reefer, you know, do your year Reefer and then see where you want to go from there, man. Well, tanker, I love tanker now, man. It's become easy. It's become like a Reefer job now. All I do, I do the same thing every day, man. It just feels the same. It feels natural now, man. I took two days. That's all I did. It took two days to learn how to do this. And I've been doing it for about two months perfectly. No problems, nothing like that, you know. I'm loving it, man. I'm thinking about doing it forever, man. Yeah, see, there you go, man. Hey, you could do whatever you want, flatbed, reefer, tanker. I chose uh, tanker, he chose reefer, but he switched over to food grade, he's loving it. 
All right, y'all. They're putting uh, my fridge in my boy Dre's truck for him right now. Yeah, Prime charges 50 bucks to put fridges in. So, but I'm heading, I'm gonna drive over here to Success Leasing and I'm gonna see if I can get a sneak peek on my truck for y'all. Uh, but I don't plan on signing the lease right now. I plan on taking a couple days off after I turn this uh, turn this truck in. Uh, let's go in here to Success Leasing. And I don't know the process of turning in my old truck. But we're going to find out right now. My boy Dre said that they're going to have me go to Bay. What Bay did he say? I got to go to... 47 I think and check in all right let's go over here and so over here to the left this is actually the success leasing uh, building here at prime and over here to the right is where all the new trucks are or used trucks that are ready so let's let's go drive over here and I'm gonna see if my truck is over here somewhere maybe we can get a little sneak peek action of it y'all let's see here what's happening what's happening okay let's uh let's keep rolling let's look around let's look around okay i'm not seeing it down this aisle not seeing it down here hey look at that another peterbilt just like mine that one's even more brighter pink look at that that thing is shining boy look at that oh yep that's girly it's got oh it's got a little some little pink bows on it pink bows All right, let's go down here to the next aisle and see if we can find it. Okay. Don't see it, I don't see it down here. Okay, we're gonna hit the next aisle. The suspense. All right, we'll let this guy back up. Boy, that truck is not clean. There's a black midriff Freightliner right here. Probably just got returned. Look, it's got people's names on these trucks, so my truck should, um, I believe it should be over here somewhere. Let's see if we can find her. I think I see a midriff over here, guys. Is this it right here? Right there baby there's my truck right there it's even got my name on it look at that boy all right let's take a look here let's go over here and take a look y'all Woo! yes i'm excited look at that baby all right boy she look good too man yeah look at that boy she look good too Ooh wee right there baby that looks good that looks real good oh and they left it whoa they left it open they left it open up in here oh man boy she looked good right here Whew. and it got the key in here so three three one five Ooh, i'll bet you this baby yeah this is looking nice here all right so I just got to get a fridge and I got my microwave and it doesn't look like it got a mattress up here yet, but let's take a look. All right, man, this is look, oh yes, this looks good. All right, cool. We got the Bluetooth, we got Sirius, I got Sirius, I already have Siri, uh, Sirius XM, so, oh yeah, this is, man, boy, I'm excited, guys. This look real, real, real good. Whoo, man. They even left it open. Let's take a look. Uh, I don't see an eco heater on the back of this right here. Man, that looked good. Boy, yeah, she looked real good too. Whew. Boy, she all nice, nice, fresh top. Man, she looked good too. Man, that looked real good. She looked good. All right, I gotta go up in here to Success Leasing. Where is that eco heater box? I don't see the eco heater. 
I do not see Oh yeah, she looks she looked real good. Whew, man, she looked good, baby. Don't worry, I'll do a full video of it. I just wanted to get a little quick sneak peek of it. Man, she looked good. Woo. All right, y'all. So I signed my uh, lease cancellation form. So it is uh, my lease is canceled with my old truck as of today. I'm currently sitting in my truck right now. There's just a couple things I got to get my little uh, my GoPro bag out and just get my badge and my drink. But um, so tomorrow at four o'clock in the morning, I could have left the truck here and just had them do like an inspection to see all you know anything that's wrong or damaged or broken or things like that uh they said that i could waive my right to not be present which i did not uh, i'm actually going to be coming back up here at four o'clock in the morning tomorrow and i have to go to bay 40. all right so we're going to walk over here to bay 40 so i can show show y'all where it's at over here to the right that's success leasing that's where i signed my lease cancellation form let me hop let me hop over this chain here real quick so the process is i had to sign that lease cancellation form and then i just came over here to bay 47. this bay right here is bay 47 tractor maintenance i checked in with them and i could have waived my right to be there during the inspection process uh, but again i did not so tomorrow at four o'clock in the morning I got to bring my truck over here to Bay 40. Uh, I see somebody doing an inspection on a truck right now. But uh, right here, guys, this is Bay 40. So this is where I'll be at tomorrow, 4 o'clock in the morning. So that way they could do my truck inspection. I will be present. Prime's already made plenty of money off of me with all the freight that I pulled for them. And I already know that they're going to stick me for the damage on the top of the truck. No big deal. But uh, I'm going to be present to make sure that they ain't trying to add things to it. So uh just want to be able to protect protect myself uh but yeah let's get it all right so they asked me if i would move my truck over by success leasing's lot so that's what i'm going to do right now which is literally right here around the corner so i'm just going to move my truck over here to this parking lot over to our right all right i'm going to back her up over here yeah but i didn't i didn't finish out the lease it is a walk away lease and I ordered a truck through Prime as soon as I could. There we go, let's back her up here. Kind of a little crooked, but that's all right. We'll get her backed in there nice and straight. No big deal. All right, here we go. So after you lease with Prime for 90 days, they give you the option to order a truck. Uh, and that's exactly what I did. I'm gonna make sure to uh, hold on to this lease cancellation paper because they'll be prorating because I'm only one day into the next uh, pay period. So uh, they're not gonna charge me for another full week. That's for sure. Okay, so I think I got everything out except my little tool bag here because I got my fridge out for my boy Dre. So I just need to grab my little tool bag and oh let me grab my gloves here and my little gloves and my gopro bag and we're good to go oh so yeah look forward to tomorrow to get this uh get this done all right y'all so i'm back here uh by my truck i just had to go talk to road assist to let them know that my truck is actually not done it's not ready i couldn't sign the lease today if i wanted to because one is there is no eco heater box on here and then i sent a picture of the back of my truck to my trainer uh sean he's the one who actually trained me on the tanker side here and there is no hydraulic pump here that's what i need to pump off the trailers into the customer's tanks in their system it shows that they set my truck up as a reefer truck which my truck is not reefer so i will give you all an update uh as soon as i can but i wanted to give you all a quick sneak peek of my truck Thank you so much for checking out my video. Make sure to give me that thumbs up, smack that subscribe button, and y'all be safe.